Now this is our third question. The following scatter plot shows the amount of grain consumed in kilogram versus the number of people in the household. So this is the scatter plot. Then the association between the two variables is positive or negative, strong or weak or zero. So first of all, as the amount of grain is increasing, we see that the number of people is also increasing. There is that positive association between them. So definitely positive is true. It is not negative. Is it strong or weak? And, and this is also not zero because it's definitely positive. Now, in terms of strong or weak, I think we can do this by trying to see what a line fit will look like. It's quite clear that there seems to be a reasonably good line fit over here. And this would indicate a fairly strong association between the variables. It is not weak definitely because as the amount of grain is increasing the number of people is also increasing it should actually be the other way around as number of people are increasing the amount of grain consumed will also increase so this is a fairly strong linear relationship that we can observe here in the second part of the question we are being asked what is the sample correlation coefficient that's what is being asked of us and what is given is the sample standard deviation of number of people which is 1.93 and sample standard deviation of the amount of grain which is 9.36 and lastly the sample covariance is also given to us which is 13.96 we have already seen in the previous problem that sample correlation coefficient is the sample covariance divided by the sample standard deviations cup product and that gives us 13.96 divided by 1.93 into 9.36 and this is roughly 0 0.7728 so our sample correlation coefficient is roughly 0.7728 which is greater than 0.5 and it is positive. So our earlier deduction that it is a strong and positive association is confirmed here because we are getting a fairly strong sample correlation coefficient.